Introducing, Introducing the Southern the Poet. Poet. Uh, mm. We're gonna get this thing started tonight. One of our first up tonight will be the Southern Poet. I want y'all to give it up for the Southern Poet. Where is it? What does he do? It's kind of like my introduction when I go in front of crowd and I'm being in front of. So I don't think none of y'all really heard this. So here he goes. It goes off. I find myself procrastinating. I can't get it done. So I blame it on the heat that's protruding from the sun. No determination, no providing with the strength of God's son. I got people prophesizing, pronouncing that I'm gonna be the one. Let me confess it. Yes, I can fool it. I'm calculating this time for the world to know it. God created me with skills, so it's time I show it. I'm introduce myself. I'm Maurice Pierre. You can call me a sub poet. Please listen to pen and paper or in a fight. Phrases form a pen, others and thrust to indict. Words accumulated by mind, which right hand will write. Listen on, even if you feel that it wasn't polite. For pen to strike paper while scribbling some profanity. Thinking, what shall I do to motivate the man in me? See, I'm thinking about the achievement right hand that we, and I'm gonna speak in faith, hoping soon y'all gonna be demanding me. I try to believe that I got my mind in it. Realizing my blunder, I put no time in it. Can't sleep in my bed at night when I climb in it. My conscience both thinking thoughts and how to rhyme with it. See, I had these thoughts earlier today about this lady. That possessed that thing that made most men go crazy. So I'm asking like R. Kelly, can we go half on the baby? She looked at me, smiled, and then said, maybe. Later that night, we smoked blunts to set the mood. Something else on our minds, so we skipped over the food. We touched, tangled, tweaked, as I thrust in the noodle. Then I realized it was me that the crowd had who. And a long pop went off and I was awakening myself. Thanking God for another day as I'm taking my breath. But praying these passing days, I'm awaiting my death. That motivation makes money, so Maurice is making my will. I'm gonna increase my confidence since God guides my small organization. It's because of him that the mind gives cooperation. Taking a paper with pen, displaying my frustration. The Southern poet you see. I'm not in your imagination. We're gonna bring up to the stage now the Southern poet one more time. Give it up for the Southern poet. I'm right into this. It's called No Strings of Text. When our eyes met, it was like a movie. You know, and I know, that you want to do it. And I, of course, want to do you too. The fire of kindle, the vibe we feel be true. Come here, and let us have a quick discussion. It's in both our eyes. We know we lust. Can you get away? We need to meet secretly. Though be sure that you wish to creep with me. Cause honest I be holding no information back. So here's info of my desire to lay you flat. I'ma ask for the ass and then ask for the number. If she give it, I'ma come play her plumber. Don't call up the nine because her man be home. We implement that even on the hour to meet alone. To connect by ties of a driven sexual desire, you and I shall attach and spark this fire. When I am, she is some sexy see-through. And no one would know what the things that we do. Smoking on a blunt, we hold idle conversation. And then she can't wait no longer. She ready for no more hesitation. So she 600 seconds of sucking and swallowing and sending seductive cheetahs through my veins. I play Professor P.I. and cook proper grades by her name. Between your shoulder, you got a good head killer. Some serious sexual moves making my man a quiver. I'm tasting titties, her nipples, nerves, knees inside my mouth. The southern poet I be, so you know I'm gonna go south. Spread, like she had a visit with her gun and colleges. Pearl tongue, pussy ball, ass fresh. I'ma lick all of this. Then she gripped and guided my stiff erection and guided to the landing zone deep off in her midsection. 
I'm powerfully pushing my erection, my penis penetrate her premises. Hope she know it could be ours when we finish this. I'm badly behaving, breast biting, nibbling nipples while inside eating. Had to tell her, don't call my back, baby. This evidence of us cheating. Run you to your climax with a powerful big thrust. You rotate your hips back and make my stick spit up. After six and a half minutes more maintaining my momentum, then I'll retract. She looks lovable and lazy, but it's time for us to subtract. I'll see us out this hotel room that we just sexed in. It's been like two hours and 12 minutes since we first checked in. Tomorrow when you see me, you ain't even got to speak. Forget about last night when I was smacking your cheeks. I admit digging deep in your dungeon was delicious, but if we do it again, then someone may be suspicious. No necessary phone calls to attach us to our one night stand. It's time for you to refocus on him who you call your man. And your name is, and your name is, see I done already forgot. So subject suggesting sex with us, just stopped. <laughs> This one here is restricted for the ladies. It's called eating dessert. So let's jump right into it. You probably think a cupcake with a cherry on top. Well, I speak of a nun, not just of a treat, no taste in every spot. As you lay on your back while my tongue is searching, my jaw is getting moist, and so your pride is in the thirst. Your breast with cupcakes is cherries with your nipples, moving my tongue with passion, trying not to make it tickle. The texture of your skin arousing my tongue tendencies. Thank you for the moment, yes, thank you for giving me the chance to appreciate the place that panties come. Not at all do I mind that you're Andy's mother. I was hungry, so you issued a satisfac satisfactory snack for an appetite. Please correct me if I stray and don't do it right. As I hurry from your breast to your navel, reaching your spot, feeling the heat rise as we both get hot. My tongue hard, ready on command, it's dutiful. Because I believe that the vagina is a thing so beautiful. It's a beautiful thing, yes, a very lovely place. Admitting that sometimes I do love to rub my face. Down there to loose my tongue to go and explore. Body parts that make the pussy move, won't even more. Then this one walls will slowly separate. You getting wet? The river will flow, so I ain't stop licking yet. Hold your shield back with my fingertips, I tongue wrestle. Your little tongue calls and cries to come from your castle. Don't get too loud unless you want someone to hear that your pussy being treated like royalty up in here. I'm gently sucking on your stub as you get well. Stop going inside the pussy, you taste better. Then that chocolate birthday cake that mom used to cook. Let your juice ease in my mouth, shit, I'm going to be hooked. Especially if I taste your ice cream when it's produced, I anticipate the moment I bet it as sweet as your juice. Then wets my tongue and lubricates your precious pussy. I go tongue wrestle some more, and then simultaneously I push me. In they spring smoothly, in yet soon I know you'll drip. My saliva seat is silly, so I got a slippery lip. My finger accommodate my tongue to bring you satisfaction. But it ain't in a minute, so you ain't gotta worry about asking. Though right now I feel your body having spasms. Place pearl tongue between lips, gently suck, and bring multiple orgasms. Your river flowing, my fucking finger feeling this sensation. Yes, without a doubt, the pussy is a beautiful creation. And I recommend you all to taste it twice. You won't hurt me. <laughs> spread it over, and imagine it's your favorite dessert. <laughs> Introducing, Introducing the Southern, the southern Poet. poet. Uh, mm. 